So your campaign, uh, your Artist Hope campaign specifically that you've chosen is raising awareness and finance for a cause out of Kenya Catelli called Organics for Orphans. So tell us a little bit about why. Why Organics for Orphans? Why Kenya Catelli? What was the thing that drew you to want to like use your creative showcase for that cause? Okay, well, um, it started my, um, my parents are climbing Mount Kilimanjaro in Tanz Tanzania in a couple months. And they were trying to find a cause to raise money for for this um, uh, project that they're doing. So they looked into some things and they came across Organics for Orphans. And um, like we'd always, we've always been really involved with Hope for the Nations and kind of projects that they've done. And so this was just another one that they came across. And it really struck a chord with me just because it's, um, it's just such a cool idea that... Uh, Oh, maybe I'll explain a little bit about what it is, but um, Organics for Orphans is basically going in and giving s villages the tools to um, have, like, be self-sustaining, basically, so that there is, things are really easily grown there. It's just that agriculture has been kind of lost in a lot of those areas just because people weren't able to make money. There's been a lot of scams that have happened that have kind of made it so that agriculture is not something that people want to do so they kind of move into slums and then their situation gets worse um, in the cities but if like with these tools like they can make these really really high output farms um, that are really easily run completely like a few people can um, work on just these small plots of land and they can feed the entire village so it's giving them a way so that they can feed themselves and um, you know, year after year. So it's not just another one of these projects where you're just giving money to something and hoping that it works out or giving aid and giving food. Like they're able to then, you know, help themselves. And then from there, once you have food, then you can work on getting education, things like that. But it's just kind of the day to day struggle of what are you going to eat that day? Like these villages, um, it's been implemented in some villages and like their entire village is fed. And so, like, just that kind of the idea. Um, it's, it's just so cool. So I, I really um, kind of clung on to that and um, I was really excited just that Art is Hope has these champion pages and things where you can, you can take that one thing that you're so passionate about that you think is just a really amazing project and then tell other people about it and let other people know and um, put into that because I think it's a really great idea, a really great project and um, it's working and it has the potential to do so much good in that area. So what are you specifically raising money for in the Organics for Orphans? Is it farmland? Yeah. Is it, just explain that maybe a little bit more. Is it like... The what, plots exactly? of land um, okay. right now is what I'm championing or trying to raise funds for. Um, there's a lot of other things that need, you know, you need to get the seeds, you need to get the... Um, just the, if the structures put in there for watering and things, but they've got a drip system, which is like the most efficient. You only need like, you know, a bucket of water that, you know, a small person could carry around. Like it doesn't take a lot at all, but um, yeah, I'm working on the land. Um, awesome. Yeah. Good. Sweet.